criminal teen heart transplant recipient dies in police chase. A Georgia teen with a checkered criminal past, who happened to be a recipient of a controversial heart transplant, died Tuesday after fleeing police following a crime spree. It all started at Perimeter Mall, when 17-year-old Anthony Stokes of Decatur stole a car and drove to Roswell, about 12 miles away. He arrived at this home on Hembry Road, where he kicked in the door, drew a gun, and shot the elderly homeowner inside. Stokes then fled the scene of the failed robbery, leading police on a high-speed chase. With officers trailing, Stokes lost control of the car. Witnesses told WSB-TV they saw the vehicle spit out of control, striking a 33-year-old woman who was crossing the street, sending her flying through the air. The car crashed into a pole, ending the chase and his life. Two years ago, Stokes made international news when the then-dying 15-year-old was denied a heart transplant because, according to doctors, he had, quote, a history of non-compliance. Stokes suffered from dilated cardiomyopathy, in which the heart's main chamber, the left ventricle, fails to pump enough blood. At the time of the transplant, Stokes told reporters he viewed the operation as an opportunity to start over. But that never happened, and it seems he instead lived and died over his criminal acts. Your smartest, most insightful comments can win you $100 only at tomonews.net.